have come along to the Safe 2 stand at the uh, National Land Board Investment Show at London Olympia and I'm joined by James and we're right next door to the NRLA stand, that's no surprise. So just uh, you are the founder of Safe 2 which is all about Land Board compliance but um, just explain what's the connection between Safe 2 and the NRLA and where, where do you fit in? So I founded Safe 2 uh, about four years ago dealing with the compliance and property safety certificates for, for landlords and it was recognised by the NRLA that it's something that is, is missing and definitely something that uh, fills the void within the NRLA. Mm -hmm. uh, so I was acquired by the NRLA in August last year. Mm -hmm. uh, I Congratulations. Was, thank you. Um, it's been definitely a, a bit of a ride. Uh, yeah, I'm now the Chief Innovation Officer and I am in charge of bringing the NRLA and landlords into a more digital era and pushing innovation within the sector. Well, you know, this is totally something that we at Property Tribe subscribe to because we believe that, um, you know, digital is the way to go and it helps landlords work much smarter, but also it's very much about risk mitig mitigation as well, isn't it? Particularly with, you know, so much compliance, but if you're caught out not being compliant, quite significant fines. Yeah, absolutely. And um, the whole point of it is to... You know, digital can be, for landlords, can be quite daunting. Mm -hmm. If something that technology, if you're not involved with it or you don't know it, it can be quite a scary, scary concept. But actually, we're here to show that it, it, can, it can help drive and revolutionise the, the industry and can help with all aspects of lettings. We're taking that, 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 the asset, the actual physical property, picking it up and making it digital. Mm -hmm. So compliance, document storage, you know, audit trails, the whole shebang, making sure you're compliant, making sure you know where to go. And if you have to, it's all there really went for you. Mm -hmm. Now we're at the Landlord Investment Show, as I said. How important do you think it is um, for landlords to take a day out of their business and to come along and gather at an event such as this? The, these events are imperative and they are so beneficial to everybody involved. I can't tell you how many conversations I've had with the group, you know, oh, I didn't know this existed, or I didn't know that existed, or I didn't know I could do that. So just getting here, networking, seeing like-minded, you know, individuals in the same sector is, yeah, it's invaluable. And you've been doing some presentations as well, haven't you? Yes, yeah, I'm learning on my, uh, you know, public speaking, trying to get out there and making the awareness again, just revolutionising that, that the, the industry and the, the rental experience. What we found with landlords and getting them to go digital is that, you know, maybe older landlords are more analog thinkers. The younger generation expect it, so I think your job's going to get easier and easier. But existing landlords are my sort of age, you know, we're analog thinkers, and I initially struggled to start using digital tools. But are you finding that once they actually, you know, adopt it, it's kind of like getting them over a hump and then their eyes light up and they go, wow, this is amazing. It's exactly <laughs> that, yeah. You know, it's just about showing it and making that, making the user experience as, as best as possible. That's what's key. So if the UX works and it's intuitive and it works as it should, mm -hmm. again, once you're over that hump, you know, that light bulb moment of actually, it's not that bad. Gone are the days where you can have a, vape, uh, a paper copy in a folder, yeah. you know, somewhere. <laughs> in the back room well. exactly <laughs> you, know, you need that you need that robust structure to be able to get to it you know pretty instantly yeah, yeah. now your your role at the NRLA um, are you just going to continue developing the safe true software or are you going to be bringing in other kind of digital innovations yeah bringing in so we are actively seeking innovations guys then and, and, and companies that can help yeah, to, to improve the experience so definitely safe to fit that bill portfolio our own our own software yep. that does as well and they, they, they synergize and work very well very well together um, at the innovation side of things we have the training so we're looking to train the landlords so I think we've done over 10,000 landlords trained now but we're looking to do a little bit more digital training to mm -hmm. say look you know, this is how you do it and this is what you should be doing I think landlords do need to get on board the digital train sooner rather than later because in the pipeline down there we've got making tax digital yeah. coming haven't we and they're not really going to have a choice whether they can get involved or not exactly is you know i think it's 20, 2026 yeah if it doesn't get pushed you know and then we've also got the the property portal as well true you know without you know without a doubt you know moving moving with the times you have to be digitalized it's where it's going it's definitely the direction yeah. of travel isn't it, it is got my work cut out oh excellent so um how are you feeling about just as we close this out how are you feeling about the landlord space uh, in the early part as we are in 2024? 
So the more I know how the NRLA work and what they do for the sector, the more positive I feel. Yeah. So there is so much on the front that, that everybody sees in the NRLA, but what you don't see is behind the scenes. Mm. And I've had that world now, so I've been six months or so getting into it and knowing actually what they do for the sector is, is just incredible. Mm. And it does make you have that sense of you know positivity around it, for sure. Mm. I totally agree with you, and I think it's very also very positive that they brought you in because they did that was a, a piece of the puzzle i think they had missing and they do need to um almost be ahead of the curve i think really yep. don't you yep. um, and to have somebody like you that's constantly pushing and expanding the boundaries i think it's very very positive it's very kind i like to think i do give a, a certain you know real world experience mm. which is which what they're, they're finding so yeah i'm hoping to do do good things well, yep. we'll watch your journey with uh, continued interest. Thank you. And congratulations for what you've achieved. Thank you and, very much. Uh, very exciting times for all of us. So uh, I've really enjoyed talking to James here on the stand of uh, Safe 2. And um, we will catch you again with another video from the Landlord Investment uh, Show. So stick around.